guys, today is the day that we are moving our ponies to the house. Probably the most exciting vlog ever made in the White family history. It's got to be. It's got to be. Um, we, we bought this house, what? Two weeks ago. Two, three. Three. Three weeks ago. Three weeks ago. And there has just been progress been made every single day. So my mum and my nan have been at the yard today working very hard, packing our horse box full of stuff uh, ready for when the ponies come home tonight. And we're actually like, oh, are we gonna, are we gonna do it in time? The ponies might have to come home tomorrow. But, oh, we pushed through. Everyone has been working so quick and I've just come home from school and... We're gonna make it happen. We're making it happen. Yeah, they're Dog gonna power. come straight home to bed. They're not gonna go out in their field. So we'll film tomorrow and you, they can see their, see their new paddocks, can't they? Yeah, but, oh, so It's a school exciting. day tomorrow though, so I don't know if you'll be, if you'll be um, impressed. No, if, you, if you'll be helping out in the morning. Look, babe, in we're going to be able to see the ponies outside. Oh, my God. Our... Look. It's oh. amazing. We've got a little, like, hoof washing area. I just need to go turn it on, actually. It's, it's actually starting to dry up, finally, just a little bit. And I thought that this area, we could, like, tie the ponies up somehow. I don't know how. Oh, maybe on the fence. I don't know. But, um, you know, if we want to do some, if it's a nice day, we can groom outside and tack them up. Um, or we will make this like all clearer inside. It's just a bit of a mess because we've literally just piling the boxes back quickly whilst we can. But yeah, we could tie them up in here and um, tack up and stuff if we need to in here too. Just until we've got the um, barn ready, but the roof and all that's going on at the moment, but that's going to be a couple of weeks work. Oh, babe, don't make it all wet in here because it's only just started to dry out. Oh, no, 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 no. No, because this is literally, this has been a pond and it, we've had two days nice weather and it's just started looking a bit nicer. But this is, this is what a barn's looking like. It's um, looking nice and cosy. Nice and warm, <laughs> nice and sheltered. Very windproof. We've done about half of it. Oh, but... no, we've done way more than that. This is like the last few bits. But I want to put this in the barn because it's good to it's like... It's well dusty. Everything's got so filthy. It'll be fine. We're going to be washing for weeks. I'm going to steal this clip. We've got rugs. We've got muddy rugs. We've got shampoos. If you name the mud, we've got it. Everything is just so awfully muddy at the moment. Like, everything has got mud and dust on it. We've got so much stuff. We're gonna need to donate some, Mum. <laughs> Is it like a horse charity? Yeah, we've done that before. We did it with all popcorn stuff. Mm. Right, we've got, we've let's got... just get the last bits here, then we can go get the ponies. Yeah. That's the exciting bit. Yes. Ooh. And we've got to get the rubber mats. Yeah. Rubber mats and ponies, that's all we rubber need Rubber mats now. are really heavy. You are all right, babe? Keep going. Oh, we've got our wheelbarrows that we... Um, we haven't put together yet. I know, we've got two massive ones, but we haven't put them, to, put them together. I have to do that after they've been turned out in the morning. Yeah. Nothing like being organised, is there, babes? I know, we're just so little organised. I feel so prepared. <laughs> I know. Yeah, um, it's quite a bit to do, but we'll get it done. Hopefully. Oh, all of these online. So they are plastic bins for soaking their feed. So I've got the green one for the meadow cobs. Oh, what are these? Are these smaller ones? I'm going to soak my hands in there. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, dear. Yeah, so I've got this. I'm going to have like, um, like sugar beet in because it's black. Um, what, did I, what did I get? I, I thought I ordered purple. They must not give me what I ordered. I can't remember. But um, yeah, I actually thought these were amazing to take to some shows as well. Like, you know, when we, we always take feed with us when we travel, um, just so they can have a nice feed after they finished. And this is great because, well, our feeds, we take them like soaking wet and they take an hour to soak. Uh, so yeah, this means that they're not gonna spill around everywhere and you've got these lids on them. Um, but I'm gonna use these for like everyday use as well. So we can, um, yeah, can like 
uh, job lot bulk soak um, their stuff, uh, their mashes and their meadow cobs, uh, which they all love. So yeah, these are really good. They're not a horsey brand. Um, it's like a plastic company, um, but yeah, it's got these nice handles. I thought they were ideal for what we needed. And then here are the massive wheelbarrows that I ordered. Um, there's actually two there, two like bases. They're huge and yeah, they've all got to be put together. So um, yeah, better get that done quick. Otherwise I won't be mucking out tomorrow. DIY'd it. What did you do? Did you do that? Yeah. Did you? Well done, darling. So you just hung it up on there. Oh, it's our little rug rack. Rock we did a couple of them actually, don't we? Yeah, that's ideal. This is like these are like the stay away show stables. Stables, yeah. So, but is the, this is one of the like barn ones, so like an American barn style one. Yeah, we've got the eco barn. These are from Chevelle Liberty, um, who also make our trailer. They are amazing, and like this is it. I knew exactly this is what we what I've, we needed. Ooh. Oh no, we might need that's a bit. the aftermath of Christmas. Yep, vlogmas <sighs> in there. I think that's why we're in a lot of state as well, actually, to be honest yeah, with you. Yeah, Vlogmas, like, took over a lot. <laughs> These stables on a want, like on a slant. Yeah. It's because the ground's all... Yeah, the ground's a little bit slopey, but it's fine. It's They still managed to be able to put them. It's only slight. Yeah, but we could just put more shavings. Yeah, and then the I made outside. sure then when I had them put down. So I've got all the mud control slabs put down over the entire barn. Um, and then we're going to put tarpaulin down stable mats on top and then, and then shaving, the shavings. Shaving. So yeah, and then, yeah, these were absolutely incredible, these mud control slabs, and we They've could been... not have put this down without them. This would be underground. It would have sunk. It would have sunk. Yeah. Definitely. So yeah, these have been a godsend. And yeah, I just made sure that we had enough space here that we can wheel the massive wheelbarrow through and the ponies can get and we've through also nice got and these like into the entrance into the field as well oh yeah we've got them everywhere yeah we'll show you like everywhere that's muddy they're there we've got to get the, oh we've also got to get the feed from their yard as well oh yes so the feed um has got to go in the bins when we get back and haylage yeah, but Nanny's gone to get the haylage, hasn't Nanny's she? Nanny's gone to go get the haylage. I'm only getting a couple. I hope she gets haylage, haylage, not hay. No, she's getting haylage. Just getting a couple um, of haylage. And then I've got a big hay delivery coming tomorrow. Um, I just want them to have haylage tonight just so they're, they, 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 they're like gorge on it. They're yeah, going to they be excited. they all love haylage. Oh, they We're going to get some lights up in here as well, aren't we, Harlow? Yeah. So we can um, do night like, checks and stuff. We can do them anyway, but yeah. Yeah, just so, you know, it's just easier. Yeah. Oh, I can't wait. So right. exciting. Are you going to help me with these, for, for, with folding these, Mum? Yeah. So we're just going to soak some meadow cobs in this bucket. Oh, I finally got the boots I bought for Cloudy. What are these for £30? Pound? Yep. I finally oh, got, got them a out. Bit of organising going on. Here. We've got yeah, boot so we've got a boot, 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 boot baskets. But yeah, it's I like think it's yard, about. Isn't it? It's turning into a proper yard. <laughs> right, we do need some light in here, don't we? Right, these are magic cobs. Should I empty these? No, I think we should leave them in there. Why? Because when they go all sandy at the bottom and stuff, it's just clean now. I think I've got enough. I've got like the so I've got nine compartments. No, oh no, I love it when they're all like. I know I do as well, but I also love it when they're not. There's not all scraps at the bottom, which we're never going to be able to get out again. You still have that in the bag, though. Yeah, but then we chuck the bag away. I've bought enough that we have that we can just have bag per compartment. We'll just see yeah, how we go. Just, just, Please, no, because, please. No, do you know what, babe? You would have to fill, put so much feed in there to fill it right up to the top. I reckon you'd need about four bags of meadow cobs. And then oh, you'd I never get... I can't even reach it. I've got to reach all the way down could... there to get them out. Get a little step, darling. And then you can... Um... <laughs> and then you can always lift the bag when the bags start getting lighter. Why have we got so many feed bins? They only have, like, three things. Well, because I thought Panda was staying. 
Panda's not staying at the minute, is he? <laughs> no. I don't, I don't think we've actually explained what's going on. No, so Panda, at our last show, it all kind of um, went extremely downhill. Um, so Panda is now at Katie Green's. Um, yeah, which is your jumping instructor that we go to in yeah, Warwickshire. Um, so Panda's up north, not on holiday, on boot camp. He is um, on proper boot camp with Katie. Yeah. You did your round and Katie was like, send that pony to me. Give me that pony, because that was... Because I, I, I had to retire from my round because that's like how bad it was going. And Katie was like, we've got a lot of work to do. So yeah, she's just sorted him out. He's on beauty boot camp. He's getting his nice coat Jumping on. Jumping boot camp. He's... She's getting a bit more weight on him because he's dropped some weight, isn't he? Yeah. And she's going to get his jumping going all good and just getting him fitter and stronger. So get some muscle on him because yeah, we haven't got him for the minute. Oh, hold on, my phone's going. My phone has not stopped all day long. Right, fab. Where's some more? Good luck. No, because we too much in a minute, babe. And these are good because these have got lids, so the rats won't be getting in them. It's yes. really thick plastic as well. Oh, I'll take this. Oh, oh, wait. Oh, is that the haylage? That's the haylage oh, that's fab. arrived. Where are we putting the haylage? In their nets. Yeah, but do we not need to, um... What's it called? Like, put it somewhere, so the, like... No, because they were using that up. I've got a massive hay delivery coming tomorrow. Shall I just leave it here? I think that's Yeah, it leave it here to put a lid on it. And then the time we get back, that'll be perfect. At least we can sweep it up here. We need that to get... needs to go. The old owner's left that. Yeah, the old owner's left all this hay, and I don't really fancy giving it to my ponies. <laughs> Not going to lie. Don't know how long it's been there. I'm going to do it in small trunks, otherwise I'm going to make an absolute mess. But I think I will. Yeah, anyway. you're going to make a mess. How are you feeling about them coming home? I'm very excited. This is what Can't... we've been waiting for. I know. For years. <laughs> Oh God, it is a big chunk. It's actually happening. Today's the day. Today's the day that the ponies are coming home. And I've got A all down my boots. <laughs> it, this goes quite far, doesn't it? It does, like, I've barely made a dent in this. But... Yeah, well, I am going to get the farmer like to come round and um deliver like a big big bell what a week yeah we're gonna be like when we when we go on properly on proper haylage i'm going to get a massive one delivered yeah because they're going to be in loads like all the haylage they're they're having loads every night like a massive two, two big nets yeah well they'll have they've got their hay bags haven't they yeah and oh, then yeah, two big big bag and then they'll have loads on the floor as well and then like <laughs> Maybe a net as well. Right, that's plenty for the drive, and then we'll top them up. We'll sort it out when we when they get in. Yeah, and shall I leave this bale here? Yeah, just leave it un under. Shall I put the pallet down? Yeah, pop a pallet down. And then we'll get all this cleaned out. We'll just run out of time to get everything done before they've arrived, haven't we? We just yeah. need to get them back. And we'll get all this cleaned out, all the stuff out. And then, yeah, all nice pallets and that. And I'll down. go get our other bells in a minute as well. Yeah, we've only got one, two little under, ones. Under, yeah, under and then all the head. other hay's coming tomorrow. So we need, need to sort that out in the morning, actually, to get it all out. Or they can all just deliver it here and then we can... <laughs> Move it all. Move it all. Right. <laughs> Let's go get the boys. Yes. Have we got the Maxi 3 trailer here? It's at this yard. Oh. We just had this amazing Lemure delivery just arrived, uh, but this is all the mini collection. I'll just show you a few of the bits. I think we'll end up doing like an unboxing reel, but these are for Harlow and Harlan. So they're all kitted out for the summer. How gorgeous is this color? We've got some nice polo tops, um, t-shirts, literally been so, 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 oh my gosh, look at that. That is, have they got my size? That is just amazing. Um, lovely base layers. We are incredibly, incredibly lucky to be uh, sponsored by Lemure. Um, 
Oh, look at that. Look at that lovely pattern, the sticky bum. Nice leggings. Oh, the, the, oh, this is for Rolo and Cloudy. Look at that, the little mini head collar. That is so cute. Oh, the walnut is just amazing. I love this colour so much. I can't decide if I love the walnut most or the, the fern. Uh, but this is the walnut. Really nice little hoodie. I have to take some nice pictures this week with the ponies after school, which is going to be amazing because we can do that now. Uh, we couldn't even go to the yard um, in the week before. Um, oh, this little cute little... Oh, that's so sweet for Harlan. Oh, he's going to love that. That is really, really nice. Um, what else? We've got hat silks. Oh, the baseball caps. I love them. Absolutely love them. Got every colour. Beautiful. Um, what else? We've got all the mini stuff, fly bonnets. Polo wraps. Been well and truly spoiled. Now this fluff. It's just got me written all over it. Like, I, I love when it's got the fluff around the saddle and the fact that I don't have to wear a half pad with it as it's well. It's built in. It's just built in. Because we love it's it for amazing. the fluff, don't we? We love the fluff and when the photo shoots as well and like when you're riding, oh, it just looks amazing. And then Rolo, he's got his little, oh my God. Rolo and Cloudy for that one. Yeah, they just, they share, don't they? Yep. That is Oh, now he's got his worker ball. saddle as well. Yeah. Perfect. It's amazing. Got little black country poppy saddle. And then this oh, is no, the Pandas. Oh, the apricot. Apricot. That is going to look... That looks like popcorns. Is it? Are you sure it's on popcorns? It's large. Oh, okay. That panda's going to look amazing in that. It's going to look so like, vibrant. And then this is popcorns. It's going to look so good in that. Because we've got the Loire, haven't we? And he looks amazing in, in the, um, the walnut and in... What's we I haven't tried the J Blue. No, he hasn't we, worn the fern yet. He hasn't worn the fern or the J Blue no, yet. No. So. He's only worn the walnut so far. Yeah, and he's going to look amazing with that. We've got saddle pads for every day of the week. We have, which <laughs> literally have. And then this is so nice. I love the brown around the edges as well. Absolutely stunning. Then this is pandas as well. That's lovely. I'm, I'm going to like rearrange all of my like um, cross country colours this year. Are you? Yeah. What are you thinking? Because he's Popcorn's always had the mint and he looks amazing in that and I feel like that is an OG colour. But I, I want to try the fern on Popcorn this year. Do you know he would look amazing in apricot? Yeah. Right, let's go get these boys. I'll see you I'll tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Thank you. Is the decorator just gone. Everyone goes at four. Yeah, four is when gets all quiet <laughs> but yeah we need to i'll pop them all there and then oh my god look at the walnut hoodie <gasps> oh my god i could just be like in it for hours <laughs> oh that's lovely oh they've never put the big lumiere on there before is that, that looks in, amazing. And the mini that is the medium so the days of popcorn and panda popcorn and panda oh they look amazing oh and they've got like are these mine yeah, they're mine. Oh my god, they look amazing. Oh my god, look at the polo. polo. That is beautiful. That is unbelievable. Oh my gosh. Oh, look and look at that. T-shirt. Those are perfect. <laughs> they're like, you're Socks. really overreacting. <laughs> you're really overreacting, Mum, but like, you've perfectly I know. Have you, have, you, have you seen the cream one? Yeah. I think I might need to squeeze in the 13 to 14 or something. <laughs> I don't blame you, Mum. Gorgeous. Right, let's go get the ponies. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I need to calm down. No, you don't. I don't need to calm down. <laughs> Soak right. it up. Right, right, so we've just arrived. We've arrived. We're going to get them all. They're not wearing any boots. No, because they were all packed. And have those funny little rugs on. Oh, Hello, oh, he's so cute, aren't you, darling? He's going to have a rug on. He's so going to have I'm a big just... glow up soon, isn't he? He's going to have a nice full clip, nice wash. Come on, hello. 
It's up, darling. It's very hairy, but it's starting to get warmer now, isn't it? Yeah. So. Exciting times. Right. One rug on. My little precious. You, you right there for a moment. We just got to get everyone else ready and raring. <laughs> right, Rose Pose, what have you got to wear? Look at Pop. Can Rose just wear that, yeah? No, he'll get a bit. Um... <gasps> Let's go! I'm going to get your rug on. Yeah. Can you move your head, please? Yeah. Oh, Pops, we're taking you home, baby. Um, oh, yeah, for the mats. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've got to get all their rubber mats up as well. Oh, Are you ready to live I'm your best precious. life? Are you ready to live your best You're life? You're going to have the best love ever. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you ready? You excited? Oh, yes. Oh, Get it's happening, boys. Rose. It's happening. So, oh. yeah, all of them have moved down a stable, apart from Rolo. Yeah, so basically we all shifted them up. So, Cloudy got a bigger stable. Because it was all windy and Popcorn didn't like the tarpaulin. Yeah. The tarpaulin was blowing and so he Popcorn's was a bit scared. Popcorn's stable. So, you are all the way up here. Oh, yes. Next to Rosie. Mm -hmm. He's so happy. Right, let's get these mats up. Has Cloudy got any mats? Oh, where have they got their... Hi, darling. Right, we can start with Cloudy's mats. Since there's no pony in it. Yeah, there they're are mats, yeah. Oh, I bet they're gross. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, Granda, you might need to do them. Granda, <laughs> did Granda, did you bring your gloves? Yeah. You did, yeah. Oh, Granda's well got done. some good gloves. We all know your secrets, Grandad. <laughs> Little man's. Oh, yes. Oh, hi. Oh, he's so cute. Oh, there are any of these our nets? I have a feeling that some of them are. Oh, no, we've bought. No, I've took the nets on. This turquoise. Oh, look, at this, look at this hairdo, darling. What's going on? Oh, what's this look? I mean, it's cute. You're but... going to have a pamper session soon with Harlow in the Harlow Spa. Yes. <gasps> Rose pose. Side eye. Do you reckon they all know? You know you come in. I won't kiss you. He doesn't like kisses on the nose. But he likes head scratches. Try and kiss him on the nose. No, it's, you don't like. <laughs> no, you see? There's no point even trying. You won't get a kiss. Right, mats are coming out. The musical ponies. Cloudy the police, Shetland. Nino. Nino, Nino. Pops! <gasps> Pops, can you believe you're going to be waking up to this face every single day? Waiting for his breakfast. Oh, I can't wait. Look, I cannot. <laughs> I know, I'm a bit annoying, aren't I? Does a dream come true? Yeah. Can't wait. We've got the trailer and the horse box. Getting the mats in there. Cloudy's going to go on the other side of the mats. And then Popcorn and Rolo are going to go in at the trailer. And then we've just got these few rugs to take. They're nose bags. We've got the feed bins that I had here as well. So they're all ready to go. Yeah. Nearly time, Clouds. I think Cloudy is travelling the most stylish. The rest are all in their pajamas. Um, I've got nothing in my pockets. Oh, that pain. Oh. It's mud matted. Oh, they're going to be looking immaculate. Every day after school, how are they oh, Grandad. Oh, we'll oh I'll put them in the back. Right, Cloudy, please be good. <laughs> he hasn't travelled for quite a few months, so just let him time to adjust. Good boy, I know it's all quite quite um refreshing, isn't it? Please don't just tank off. 
Granger, please may you do this because I'm scared he's going to tank off and it's pitch black. <laughs> I'm just not as strong as you. <laughs> he's quite strong. Thank you. Right. <laughs> you want to do something with that one as well? Please don't bite me. Right, guys, we're going to try and film as much as we can when we get home, but it is pitch black, so. We don't know what we're going to see. Yeah. Oh, I'll check these in the back. Right, I don't know if you're seeing this, guys, but we have got one pony home. He's the first one to step foot on the on the white family camp. He. He, we needed to get the rubber mats off. We need to get him off in order to get the rubber mats off. So he's just free roaming all down there. Um, he is enclosed, don't worry, um, I hope. He's having a little bit of dinner, isn't he? Yeah, but he went under there and there's loads of bushes and he went under the bush and then put his head up and then it bashed his head on the tree. So he came galloping down here because he got scared. <laughs> this just looks so weird. We've got a pony in the garden. I know. I can't get my head round this. I know. We gave him, I gave him some food. He gets really sweaty when he's traveling. Um, and we did open a window for him, but he just gets so sweaty. Um, yeah, he was pretty sweaty, wasn't he? Yeah. So I'm just gonna take his rug off and let him cool down. Cause he's so We've hot. Got popcorn and Rolo waiting in the trailer. Yeah, but we didn't want to take one off. Um, oh no, they and need then to be not ready. take the other one off because they got separation anxiety. So they both need to be ready at the same time to come off at the, at the same time and go into their stables at the same time. <laughs> Popcorn needs a little holding hand, doesn't he? He does. He needs a friend. He needs Rolo. He relies on Rolo a lot. He does, and Rolo relies on him. <laughs> no, Rolo's very self sufficient. Rolo is quite self sufficient actually, but if he's in the field by himself, no, no. But Pop um, One's quite, quite needy. He is a bit needy. I feel like if he was, if he was, if he was to have a girlfriend, he'd be like, oh, can you make me? Oh my God. Oh, he's quite dusty. <laughs> but he's having some meadow cobs. So, Ooh. oh, so what's, um, yeah, so the plan is we're going to have popcorn, cloudy, Rolo, because popcorn will want to see Rolo and then he'll want to hear Cloudy. So, so that was the whole setup. Yeah, everything evolved around popcorn. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh but yeah, it's looking very cluttered in here, isn't it? I've tried to be organising it, Mum. <laughs> you haven't lifted a finger. I've been busy, I've been doing other stuff. I've done my best. I know, darling, I know, but it's just, I know we're gonna have to, well, the shavings, the will shavings go in a minute. The shavings aren't helping, Mum. They'll be going in a minute. Do you know what's not helping? It's pitch black. We're trying to do this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Only us would do this in the, in the dark. I know. Everyone would be like, oh, yeah, wait till the morning. Ah, uh -uh, not us. <laughs> Loonies. Oh, he's got a hay net here, actually. Clouds, would you like some hay as well? I ain't actually got anything, darling. I just need to capture you. Because I know you'll, you'll zoom off otherwise. Oh my god, oh my god. What should I do with him? I've, I've, caught, I've caught the beast. What should I do with it now? I don't know. <laughs> you told me to catch him. I know, because was, it was going off. I didn't, I didn't want him galloping off. It'll be fine. He's food orientated. Harlow. Harlow. Oh my god, it's grass. <laughs> but you know what he keeps on doing? He keeps on running all the way down there, then running back. He's doing laps. I know, I keep missing it, but he's literally just doing one little trot, comes back and stands still and then trots off. You don't know what he wants to do. Well, I'll get in hold of <laughs> Oh yeah, let's get in here and hold the, hold the sheet down. That gate's shut, isn't it, babe? Pretty sure it is. Um, yeah. Right, we're coming in. Oh. If you catch hold of that end, and we'll drag it up in this corner.
Is that going off more than a... A little bit. Right, see. So. I'd have to have a little gap on that. Where's he gone? Oh, yeah, it's fine. We'll, we'll put, they've got loads and loads and loads of bedding. Cloud? Cloudy baby? Can't even see him. Oh, there he is. He likes to go into the bushes. <laughs> and then he gets scared and he comes back. Are you having fun? <laughs> oh, messy. It's, getting, it's raining, so he's... Oh, spicy. Last one. I think you're going to need one more. I think need one more now. I've got a stub muffin. He's been a very good boy. Let me just check it's not mouldy, yeah? Oh, good boy. Oh, he needs a glow up, this pony. You can have two because you've been such a good boy. You're doing your laps, aren't you? <laughs> Get them calories back in the system. He's doing his best bit of help by standing on the mats as we're trying to get them in. Yep, he's really investigating there. Lots of moral support we got out from Cloudy. Everyone wants a little Shetland in their life. There is a ledge there. <laughs> and I don't know if you'll be able to split 360 round. Because it's a lot of stuff. I wouldn't personally recommend for your size coming in here as you might not be able to get back out. <laughs> I've got no more. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> he's fine, don't worry guys. Oh, he's building a china shop, this one. Is the gate closed, yeah? Is it closed? Yeah, it is. No, you wait. We're going we're to end there having our dinner. Pony's over the fence. I think Cloudy likes this routine of just like wondering where he oh, wants. Oh, he does. It's like having a, dog, a big dog. Come here, darling. I'll take him. Come here. You got some more in there? Oh, no. What's he done? Yep. Oh my god, he's nearly tripped over because he's bucking. You got some more feed there? Look. Oh. Is <laughs> <laughs> the gate closed? Yeah, the gate is closed. You okay, um, babes? Um... It's going to be really awkward. In you go. Whew. So we only put three bells down because we're just running out of time, aren't we? Yeah. Oh, he's having a oh. week. <laughs> oh, darling. Let me take your head colour off. Yes, yeah, so we only put three down and we're going to put two more down tomorrow, but we just got to get the other boys sorted so they can get in. Um, but that is plenty. It goes really far, actually. So... Oh, Cloudy is it's raining outside, so he is a bit wet. So we'll let him dry off, get him a hay net. We've the got to sort out yet as well. It's all a bit, a bit carnage. Good boy. Got him hay net. Oh, careful, we don't do the runner. I need to get him some water as well. We actually got quite a lot of torches. We've got quite a lot of torches, yeah, and they're all like magnetic, so they're all. That's brilliant, isn't it? Yeah. Grandad's just gone to go get us a pitchfork. We're on the second stable. I did the first one. Oh my God. That's how you do it. The pro. Oops, sorry. So that's just one bell. They go so far. And then tomorrow we'll add some more in. Yeah. Yeah. I think Whilst we'll they're in the field, we'll add another in. Well, I think we'll add two more in. Yeah, because we love them. Nice big beds. I think Hallie just had a roll. Yeah, so do I. <laughs> oh, he looks like a snowman. <laughs> Oh, don't, what are you doing, babes? <laughs> what are you doing? 
Oh, it just tested to see how strong they are. <laughs> what, the door? Yep. <laughs> it sounds like a bull in a china shop. Oh, he is. Oh, now he's, he's going to, this is what he does. He rolls in his bucket. He has to, he has to stand in it and then he's got to roll on top of it. We oh, messed his bed up. Oh my, <laughs> Cloudy! <laughs> what are you doing? You're so crazy. Oh, it's gone all steamy, the camera. He's made a right old mess. Sorry about this quality, guys. I am feeling, filming at like in the pitch black. Oh, he's now going to eat his dinner, Harlow. Now it's covered in shavings. Oh my God. I can't believe how much he's messed his bed up with all the food. Is it destroyed? Yeah. So all the stables are finally done and it did take quite a while, but we've got Cloudy in, but we haven't got Pat, Popcorn or Rolo in yet um, because they need to come in at the same time, exact same time, like spot on, like milliseconds apart. They'll start hyperventilating. Glued. Yeah, they're glued to each other. Like one comes off the ramp, it's got to stop as soon as the feet come off the ramp and, and wait. they wait for the other one to come off. So like it's quite, oh, you've got to time, time it right. But yeah. And I, I know we're going to get a lot of questions asking, where's Panda? Where's Panda? Have you sold Panda? Oh my gosh, where's Panda gone? Have they sold Panda? No, we have not sold Panda. Panda's not going anywhere. He's um, away for training at the moment at Katie Green's, my jumping trainer. And he's away there for training and... We don't know for how long. We don't know for how long. We're just going to see when everything starts clicking, basically. Um, and then I'm going to go out there for lessons when I go up there on Rolo for lessons. And we're gonna um, meet Panda at shows. Yeah, we're meeting Panda at shows. With Katie. Yeah, so I'm still gonna see Panda a lot, but obviously not as much as if he would be here, so. Yeah, and it's just to get yeah. him up and running properly, really. Up and running, really. because yeah. I can't do everything by myself. Like, I'm not an adult, I can't trade up not to 110 tracks, you know, so. It's gotta have someone do it properly, the correct way, and yeah, so. Yeah, I'm fine with Rolo. He's, he's, he's easy. Um, and the others are pretty easy too. But I just, with Panda, it's a 40, big, big pony. And I don't really know what I'm doing. <laughs> so, getting it out the proper way. And also, while we haven't got an arena, it's actually worked out pretty well. Yeah, but The plan was for him to come home, wasn't it? And then... Yeah. But what, it's actually worked out better because while we haven't got an arena, Panda needs, like, consistent work. Um, and hacking just won't cut it, so... Um, all the others are fine. Rolo's Easy. Is, Rolo's happy chappy. So really, you're going to have two to ride? Yeah, two to ride. We have got absolutely amazing hacking. There's so much hacking from here. Um, it's it's amazing. Um, I can't wait. But yeah, we're going to get up. I might have to ride popcorn. <sighs> right, so who's taking who? Just before we get one off. Because otherwise it's so popcorn um, off. But he's already getting rare in. Oh. Maybe Grandad will take popcorn so I can video him. Okay. It's not oh. the moving vlog I envisaged in the pitch black. I know. And it's starting to rain as well. Rolo, please don't go off because you set popcorn off. Yeah, popcorn's go is like <laughs> right. fuming already. Looks like it's not rearing up now. Right, right Grandad, do you want to take Rolo and then right, don't just don't, keep, keep, don't keep Rolo on the ramp then. Don't, keep Rolo. don't move. Oh, he's moved. We'll have to come back for the A-nets. Oh, God, you're tied to there as well. Oh, God. I didn't realise that. Oh, sorry, darling. We'll, guess the, we'll just get the A-nets in a minute. Ooh. Home sweet home, guys. Home sweet home. He's like, where am I? It is a building site at the front here. Right. Three, two, one. In we come. Good boy. Good boy. Nice big beds. Is he going to roll? You know he's pooing. Oh, was he pooing? So, oh, so. Oh. So Cloudy did a wee straight away and Popcorn did a poo straight away. <laughs> With his head. Look, look how deep the bed is, guys. Oh, 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 oh Grandad. Where's Grandad gone? 
let's pop him away. Oh, perfect height for you, isn't it? Oh, Grandad, just come here a sec. He's coming. Cloudy's in there too, darling. Do you want to take him? Well, this one's cool as ice, this one. Don't bat an eyelid at absolutely anything. He just thinks he's at a stay away show. Yep. He's like, oh, biggest bell I've had. <laughs> I know, when we go to a stay away show, we only not, normally put down two bells. Yeah, he's got four. Oh, and he's having a wee straight away. Oh, it's the wee wees. Everyone's got the wees. You right there, Pops? Is he going? <whistles> yep, he's mm -hmm. going. Oh, you got, you got all shavings on your nose, Joe. Well, we'll make their feet. Oh, Cloudy's wheel as well. Oh! They were both in at the same time. Well, let me just close this a second, darling. Popcorn's going to roll, I think. Popcorn's going to roll. Oh, Rolo's rolling, I think. Oh, now Popcorn's having a wee. Oh, Papa Doodle. And shall I get him all some meadow cobs? Yo, let them just, just suss themselves out. We need to go get those hay nets. Gosh, we've got a lot of sorting out to do tomorrow. I know. Oh, thank you. Cloudy's there too. We look see. at this one. Oh, I know, darling. I know I won't kiss you. This one literally doesn't care. No. Cause the cucumber. Oh, why are they all banging their nozzles? They're sussing it out, aren't they? Hi, Clouds. Look, how do you, look, 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 come here, pop on your nose. Pops! Look, it's his nose! <laughs> Not bothered at all. Oh, a lot of work to so see. they can all see each other. Well, apart from Cloudy, he needs a little step. Yeah. <laughs> he needs a ramp. He's taking it all in, yeah? But you weren't expecting this. <laughs> Probably a bit hungry. Oh, look, oh, we've got to film this one. His rolling is something else. He sits up like a dog. Yep. <laughs> oh, that mane. Harlow, you've got to come look at this. What's that for? The voice is free. <laughs> you nailed some there, did you, darling? Keep your mouth shut next time. <laughs> Keep your mouth shut next time. I may not be a horse, but it might be a top tip. I made, I spent a long time making those, those, those banks. <laughs> they're quite big stables actually, aren't they? Yeah, they're three by three. Right guys, we're gonna head to bed now and we're gonna get up bright and early tomorrow morning and we're gonna film getting them ready and putting them in their brand new fields. I don't know what the first reactions are gonna be. We're gonna ask all to take them at the same time. I know. We've got granddad, granddad will help. <laughs> Yeah, he will. And they're all having their dinners now. Yep. Got massive hay nets. Yeah, they've got huge nets. Um, they've Popcorn's got his massive his massive bag. Rolo's got a massive net and loads on the floor. And then Cloudy's got a massive net. So they've all got loads. Yeah, they're all tucked up. They've all got their feeds. I need to just quickly rug up Cloudy um, before we go. I'm going to leave them for the second. He's quite muddy. Yeah, he is. I know, he's rolling out there. I've seen him. Oh, my God. But, yeah, we've got lots to organise tomorrow. Um, so much to do. But, yeah, it's going to be fun. It's going to be very fun. Right, guys, we're going to head to bed now and we'll see you in the morning. Right, guys, good morning. Morning, baby. Oh, he's hangry. So, all the boys are here. I'm doing it by myself because Harlow's gone into school this morning. So, popcorn, as you know, he's been on an ulcer medication since January. And especially with the move, because it can be quite stressful, he's having a uh, gastrogard, which is, um, yeah, just medication. He's normally only having half. But because of the move, he's having a whole one. He had a whole one like two or three days before he moved. And then he'll have a whole one for a few more days yet. Um, just while 
everything's a little bit different and then he'll go back to half um, of Gastrogard for a couple of weeks and I think he will be done um, and he'll be all back to normal hopefully. He also has another thing um, which he's got from the vet um, so I'm just going to give him that. He has to have this um, half an hour, he has to have it on an empty stomach and then half an hour um, oh, what am I doing? Here we go. Oh, Rolo's having a wee. Have this on an empty stomach, then half an hour he has to have something else, and then half an hour after that he can have his breakfast. So it's a little bit of a routine, but we will do what we've got to do, won't we, Popcorn? So, good boy, come here. Oh, he's a little dream, isn't he? Very good boy. He's an angel. Shall I get the rest of that off? Or am I pushing it? That's it, lick it all off. Perfect. Right, so that's done. So half an hour, I'll give them the next thing. And then half an hour. So they've all got to wait for their breakfast because they've got to wait for popcorn. I don't know, babes. Oh, so good. So good. Little angel for that, aren't you? Oh, yeah, so you're going to put them together the wheelbarrow. I'll pop that there. I'll make up that little paste. Um, then I've got to get them, have, make their breakfasts, get them all rugged up and pop them out in the field. And I do wonder what they're going to be like. I wonder if they're just going to like go for it with the grass or they are going to go crazy. Uh, but Harlow's actually coming home at lunchtime. She'll be home at one because she's not going to a school match today. So yeah, she'll be back. She really wanted to do all of this this morning, um, but she had to go into school. Um, so yeah. Lots to do, lots to do, darling. But it's just amazing to get have them home. It's actually really surreal, isn't it? Yeah, you're a good boy. Yeah, they're so relaxed, they're so chilled. I'm so chuffed with how well they've settled. Cloudy was a little bit all over the place last night because he was running around that paddock, but I think he was just excited and um, yeah. <laughs> Good boy. But as soon as he got in the stable and then the others turned up, he was just so quiet. So, uh, yeah, they are all happy boys, I think. You've got lots of and lots of hay left and lots of water. So it's all good. Right, so I don't know how much of a good idea it was to have the feed straight outside their door because it was staring at me. Hangry boys. Um, but yeah, I'm just get, getting their breakfast ready for when they can all have it soon. Yes, I know, Cloudy. It's still an absolute mess in here from last night. I've got to get rid of all these shaving bags. I've got to tidy up in here because it's just, it's just a mess, basically. I don't know how much I like this bucket either. Like. I know I, this is what I bought it for, but it's all really like compact. It's very hard to scoop it out. So I might just keep this for stay away shows. Um, but ours have a lot of meadow cobs um, because it's just, we just like them having like really high fiber diets and it's good for keeping like their flank area like filled out, um, which well, it's Panda especially that needs it. Um, but yeah, Katie's sorting all that out. Now he's with the, um, with her, so she's producer. So she's doing all of that. He's, um, yeah, when we get him back, he should be hopefully a different pony. Not that there's, you know, anything, um, you know, drastically wrong with him, but he just needs a bit of tweaking. He just needs to be made a bit easier for Harlow um, and, yeah, he just doesn't help her out at all with the jumping um, when he's going to a fence. She'll get him all powered up, geared up into the fence. It's not been that obvious until we did our recent show, but we get him all powered up. She gets him, you know, perfectly going into the fence. And then he, he kind of just like almost stops and then decides to like catapult sometimes. So, um yeah, Katie's just trying to like sharpen him up a little bit, get him getting jumping easier and then also get some more weight on him, fill out the flank area because he has dropped off 
um, dropped off some weight. So, yeah, she's feeding him lots and lots and lots. Um, so, yeah, I actually don't know how long he's going to be there. It could be, it could be a month. It could be six months. It could be a year. We just don't know. So, we will see. But it's exciting. Um, I'm excited to see his progress and Katie is phenomenal. Um, I could not think of anyone better to to have him and I'm so glad we've we've met Katie. Um, so yeah, uh, right, what do they need now? We're going to give them some fibre nuggets as well. Yes, Rolo, it's going to be worth the wait, darling, I promise. So I am going to have to soak that. Um, and then a bit for clouds. I need to get some more of this actually. I need to ring up the feed shop. I need to sort all this out. Like Harlow's put, oh, that's Panda's go fast stuff there. Absolutely do not need that for any of this lot. So Rolo's is that one. I'm going to give him some super so calm now. So yeah, we use Equine America um, supplements, which are amazing. So Rolo has super so calm just to keep him well says it in the name really and we've got a new tub of joint supplement for popcorn because he's a little bit older mm, that smells lovely oh right see what time it is right so popcorn can have his little syringe it's just a powder mixed with water and then he has that and then it we got to wait a little bit longer then it's time for breakfast but they're all being very good aren't you guys right so that is all done oh it's actually gone all over me it's all in my hair it's all in my coat right excuse this mess i'm going to sort it once they're out in the field i'm going to sort all this mess out but cloudy's finished his breakfast first so he's going to go to the field first come on then babe oh my gosh i'm absolutely filthy what with popcorn's medicine all over me. Oh my God, Cloudy, no personal space, babes. Come on. Oh, this is perfect with these, these mats here. But let me just turn this camera on. So I've got to pull this back here. Lovely, right, Clouds. open up this gate shut this gate again i actually don't think it's going to go anywhere I'm just going to take that off all right no spiciness from this one so this is cloudy's little paddock all right let's go get the other two right they're all in Popcorn went straight for the grass. He's not just, he's not come up. Just got to sort their waters out now. I'm going to go do that now. Oh, this is amazing. Bless them. Is that nice grass, Pops? Is that yummy? I actually thought they were going to be galloping around like crazy. So this is Rolo's paddock here. Oh dear, Pops, them legs. Oh dear. I think we need to put some more of the, the mud slabs around his entrance. It's just super boggy in some places. Like this bit's all dry, but then some areas are just really wet. Oh, I'm just so happy, guys. I can't get over this. Cannot get over that. They're just, they're in our garden. There's just like no better feeling than this. So you can see like we've just got like no barn walls or roof at the minute, but that will change pretty soon. So um, 
yeah we've this was like i split it up into four because obviously we've got four ponies and the plan was that panda's coming going to be coming but then after the show a few days ago um he's gone to katie so yeah this one will just be resting this one now and then this one as well i am going to be getting that one reseeded um just to make the grass quality a bit better and we're going to spray off the moss as well so i need to get that sorted but yeah i'm just going to try and make that as nice as possible uh for this summer i'm just going to leave it for now because they've just got so much grass to eat down in here and it's quite like uh rutty the ground like it's just very very deep so i'm hoping they will tread it down as well but after we've got the arena um and that done um, i don't know when that's going to be but um i will get this all like rolled and re resurfaced basically well re reseeded just to make it as nice as we possibly can um we've also got this little t grass turn out in here but that needs a bit of love in that one and then we've got where the stables are when, especially when the, that barn comes down we could turn out in it now but i'm not going to um but when that barn comes down that will be its own paddock as well and then we've got the all weather paddock which i haven't sorted out yet but um, that's all going to be sand and something i'm going to make like a paddock paradise i don't know if you've heard about that uh, but that's on my to-do list but we're not not desperate just yet um but so yeah lots to do but they've got plenty of grass for the minute <laughs> definitely he's literally walking around on a mission just like grabbing grass as quick as he can because he thinks it's going to go I would eventually like to start turning them out together um, or in twos when we get panda back um, but that's not something that I'm going to start experimenting with whilst they're trying to settle in um, so that's just something for the future um, we'll just have to see how that goes but we'll just get them used to it as it is at the moment right I'm back from school guys and straight on it but it's starting to rain and oh my gosh the shaving sock so we need to empty this and then we need to go get the hay um and then the hay out of the hay steamer and for the hay nets basically uh, we still got a little bit of haylage left but um popcorn needs to have steamed hay which is just better really mum did all the mucking out and i'm actually pretty impressed she didn't take out too many shavings always a good sign there we go that's all right i'll just put this bit up I think we need to get some like little field shelters for the ponies. Well, no, we don't need them. No, no, just like a little, almost like a little tent, like a wooden. Right. Even if it's just got like four legs with a roof. I oh, know, but like when it's raining, we've <laughs> got no shelter. And Cloudy and Rolla got the trees. We've got all the barn stuff going on at the minute, and we've got a new roof going on today. Very exciting. Right. Oh, look at that. Lovely jubbly. Shall I put all this into there? Yeah. I went in backwards on that. I can't really turn around. <sighs> right, then that's uh, Pokemon's got a, Pokemon's got a bag. Now, guys, we're not going to be those like people who have like really pristine sweep bed beds. Like, we're not like that. The rubber mats are a bit wonky, so we can't live up to that luxury, I'm afraid. Um, but the most important thing is that they've got lovely, nice, fluffy beds and enough to eat, <laughs> and in clean living conditions because we don't need perfect banks in our life. I mean, I'd love to have them, but I'm afraid. Where's the front bit? The front bit will always be a bit messy, but the whole like bed is always going to be clean. It's just something we can't help, I'm afraid. 
I'm just going to do a hay top up for Cloudy. And then, like, they'll have. It's also time now, it's like four o'clock. So then they'll come in, we we'll have to wash their feet off, don't we? And then, like, change their rugs, we we'll have to give them a quick brush. And then we need to tidy up a little bit, and then we'll give them their dinner. So. And then, if they're, like, really low on hay by that point, we've got quite a bit spare. Ugh. If these doors were any smaller. Hold on. This is how much hay Rola had left over this morning because I put so much in his stable. Like this night was bulging at the seams. And then he had so much on the floor as well. Um, but that way we just know he's had enough because when they're full, they'll stop eating. Um, but we want to make sure that they've got loads and loads and loads so they can stuff their faces as much as they want. And then Popcorn ate all of his hay this morning. So we're going to give him even more tonight. Because we want to be seeing leftovers in the morning from where they've had so much that they physically can't eat it all. Rolo's bed is all nice and clean, thanks to Mummy. And then he can have this, and then like before we go, before we go back in the house, he will give him some more on the floor. Perfect. So I'm now in Popcorn's stable, and he's going to have all of this <sighs> he's waiting by the gate so we just come to get him in um, and we've made their dinners all up do you want to come through man? popcorn's legs look really muddy he's definitely going to need a hose off um, I think we're going to need to put some mud control slabs down here yeah, oh. Got loads left over. Yeah. You coming? I'll wait here. Mind your feet, mind your feet. Good boy. Oh yeah. This rug needs a wash. Ooh, very muddy. Look at that. A roll. Lovely jubbly. I might give him a quick little brush just so he's not too grubby. I don't know really, you got cloudy out there, don't worry bud. They all want popcorn. You're very popular, aren't you Pops? Ooh, we've got a poo stain. Someone was lying down last night, weren't they? Yeah. I'm gonna get all the um, shavings off before I put his rug on. Oh my God, that's right in my ear. Come here. They all got separation anxiety. Cloudy, he's running away from Granddad. Oh my god. Oh my god. We're low chill. Cloudy <laughs> got a bit scared he was being left by himself. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down, darling. That's the calm, calm. Calm, calm. Calm. <laughs> Right in my ear. I think my eardrum's damaged after this. Poor girls. <laughs> I do love you, but that is a really high pitched whinny.
aggressive, am I right? Oh, <laughs> oh he's seen the camera up. <laughs> right, guys, we're just popping all the boys to bed now, and we are going to film lots and lots of routine vlogs for you guys soon. We've got... Um, sorry, I'm just scared he's going to start charging out. Um, we're go we've got after-school routines, winter, ru winter morning routines, winter afternoon routines, summer routines, like, literally... Name a routine and we're, we we can make it basically. And we're going to be filming all of our, jo our journey with um, the barn renovation as well. So yeah, there's lots to lots to do. But yeah, we're gonna put the boys to bed, get them fed, change their change them into their pajamas. Thank you so much for watching today's vlog, guys. I still cannot believe that this dream has finally come true. Um, but yeah, uh, thank you so much to everyone who's watching the channel and supports us. And yeah, thanks for watching today's vlog and we'll see you in the next one. Bye!